Hey, what's up guys? Daniel here in the tech studio. I just got sent these AirPod looking earbuds and I gotta say, they really surprised me. So let's get into it. So I'm gonna butcher this name. K-Mook? I don't know. You can check the link in the description below to check it out for yourself. So in the K-Mook, we have six hour battery on a single charge up to 30 hours with the case, which is pretty good. Just open the case to start pairing. Good news. Y'all know I love to complain about USB-C and we got USB-C. IPX8 waterproofing and it comes with silicone tips to help stay in your ears. And finally something that is actually kind of rare to see. You can use either earbud at a time without it disconnecting. Let me explain. Usually with earbuds in this segment the connection is linked to only one earbud and if you put that one earbud in the case it will disconnect for both. Here you can use either one by itself without it disconnecting, and I think that's a really nice touch. I gotta say, the AirPod design is my least favorite design by far. It is definitely not my preference. It doesn't create a seal in your ear like regular earbuds, so there's a lot of ambient sound that's bleeding into your ears, and they kind of just hang there, and they make my ears sore after like 30 minutes. Plus, I have to adjust them a lot more than regular earbuds. It's just, it's a whole mess. I, I don't like it. But other than the fit, it looks fine. The case is very compact, USB-C, touch controls are pretty intuitive. And at a quick glance, they kind of do look like AirPods. <gasps> quick, was I wearing an AirPod or a KMOOC? You got three seconds. <laughs> So here is where I actually got genuinely bamboozled. So on Amazon and even in person, these really do kind of look like AirPod knockoffs. So my expectations is that these are going to be not that great. I am genuinely surprised about how good these are. If you love bass like I do, this is the one for you. I am actually blown away. These are actually so good way beyond my expectations. But if you prefer your sound to be more balanced and a little flatter, I actually wouldn't recommend this for you. They really put the bass up to 11 on this one and I'm not mad about it. But all this does mean that clarity is gonna suffer a little compared to more expensive earbuds. But honestly, these are my favorite sounding earbuds. Music and videos are amazing as for meetings and phone calls they're fine they're okay nothing amazing or spectacular there if you already have a pair of airpods or if you like this style of earbud i definitely 100 percent recommend it i personally don't like this genre of earbud if they could add this sound into a normal pair of earbuds, they would be my go-tos 100%. And I know I said that the Let's Fit T20s were my go-to, link in the description if you wanna check out that review, but I think I have a new champion. So go ahead and check out the KMOOCs. So what do you wanna see reviewed next? Let me know in the comments below. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you never miss a new video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.